Hey guys, and welcome back to Fire Emblem Three Houses, The Golden Deer, Part 33. In this episode, we'll just explore some of the monastery. after I stopped recording the last episode. So I had to redo some of this and I got some other ones. Ready to go. But what I was saying is that that I have this axe that I got. A sacred weapon, which is Lawrence's well, crest. But first, let's see some support conversations. Lysithia, it's no good for you to expose yourself to such strong sunlight, and a chill could steal upon you at any moment. You really ought to have worn a mantle. You have been running yourself absolutely ragged. Would you please consider taking some rest? Enough is enough. I am fully aware. Now, stop following me. I'm only concerned for your health. That's great and all, but I feel fine today. And I'm perfectly capable of caring for myself. I don't have time to take a rest. I'm overloaded with work, and I have less time than else. I just want to do my own thing. Bring order to the Alliance, and put my parents' minds at ease. No need to rush. How can you be so certain your lifespan is shortened anyway? I do not know who decided that, but consider me skeptical. If you are healthy now, and if you take proper care of yourself, you ought to live just as long as anyone else. That's all well and good, but those vitamin-packed sweets you brought tasted weird. If you want a healthy body, then you need to start with what you eat. You have a point, but those health sweets are gross. I sent for the finest in wholesome, healthy treats for you. I asked only for the very sweetest. That was pretty nice of you. I'm sorry, Lawrence. Thank you for being so thoughtful. Still, I don't need bushels and bushels of them. Gaining a ton of weight won't exactly lengthen my lifespan either. I mean, I'd like to be able to hang out with you as much as possible. And for as long as possible. Truly? Oh, I'm so glad. I feel the same. Even in an otherwise perfect future, I still cannot see a happy life for myself without you in it. In fact, the more time we spend together, the more essential to me you become. So let us walk side by side toward a future together. Yikes! Keep it down, will you? Why are you flustered? What is there to be embarrassed about? You know I will always care for you. Okay, okay, noted. Will you just calm down already? You need not worry about a thing. I will look after you no matter what may come. After all, the future of Fodlan rests upon my shoulders, does it not? I won't give up on myself either. Thanks for caring, Lawrence. Did I just hook up? Because I got an ace card first. Farewell. Just a moment, Hilda. How are you feeling? Sorry? Oh, uh, fine. I'm doing just fine. I'm glad to hear it. I had heard that you requested a substitute for your cleaning duty due to an illness. <sighs> you really do know everything, Seth. 
Just prior to that, you also asked for someone to take your place with table set. I believe that was due to a uh, wrist injury. It was not too serious, I hope. Ah, you heard about that. The wrist is all healed up, thank you. I seem to recall also that you declined to participate in a mock battle. That was due to a headache, yes? I have a very fragile body, you see? <laughs> it's so kind of everyone to make accommodations. Indeed. It is a great friend who offers to help without complaint. See that you treasure such friends, and that you return the favor. Of course! Well then, I should really be... By the way... Was there something else you wanted? It so happens I am on my way to the chapel to offer my prayers. Would you care to join me? No, oh, no, I, I wouldn't want to intrude. I've already offered up all my prayers for the day. Marvelous. We must always remember to give our thanks to the goddess. It is essential that we offer our prayers to her each day, that we reflect on our deeds and strive to live as she would want us to live. For the goddess sees all that we say and do. Oh, I... Now, if you will excuse me. Of course. Goodbye now. How oh, is Sedith so scary? It feels like he can see right through me. I guess that's his way of saying stop being lazy. I wish he'd just scold me outright. This is precisely why I try to avoid him. <laughs> Professor Henneman, you wanted to speak with me? Miss Marianne, hello. Uh, do pardon the mess. Uh, please have a seat. Of course. I have been puzzling over why your father would wish to conceal your crest. And I have arrived at a conclusion. Would you like to hear it? No, I... I would rather not. Ah, fair enough. Then I will keep it to myself. However, if my theory is correct, well, then it is only natural for you and your father to try keeping your crest a secret. That said, I feel I would be remiss if I didn't point out that I consider this decision a most grievous error. I'm not sure what you mean. Crests never manifest in someone unfit to bear them. Which means, Miss Marianne, you have the ability to make the most of your crest, because it is, by definition, your crest. I have no desire to make use of my crest. But it can be of service to you, and I would venture to suggest, to the world at large. Ever since I was born, that crest has been nothing but a burden to me. My parents, too. Ah, that's right. I have heard that you were adopted. Did one of your birth parents also have that crest? Uh, yes, it was my father. Then that crest is evidence that you are your true father's daughter. Concealing it, hiding that truth from the world, is denying your true parentage, is it not? I don't... I'm not suggesting you flaunt your crest. That would be highly unnecessary possibly even dangerous. I simply wish you to accept who you are. Accept it? Accept the crest and allow its power to come forward. Then it will open itself to you. Whatever the crest may be, whatever its origin or its nature, it can serve you. It is yours to command, however you wish. Mine? Nobody can decide how to use your crest, Miss Marianne. That choice is yours alone. I will... Um, I will think about that.
I heard what you did. I'm disappointed, Leonie. Um, hi, Shamir. What have you heard exactly? You aimed your bow at a group of students passing through the monastery. Was this your idiotic idea of training? I told you to be cautious. I'm sorry. Idiotic's a bit harsh, though, isn't it? What were you planning on doing after you took aim? Shooting passers-by? <sighs> of course not. If you want to train, choose a target you can actually shoot. I know. Everyone was pretty mad. I really am sorry. Nobody's happy to have a bow pointed at them. My mentor used to do that kind of thing a lot. Mentor? Was that Gerald? I don't know much about him. Would he really do that? Would and did. Mostly when he was drunk, though. Not a good habit to emulate. From now on, only aim at bugs, like I showed you. But, um, I don't really like bugs. You don't like bugs? That should make you want to aim at them even more. I just can't look at them. Seeing all the extra legs and things, ugh, makes my skin crawl. Then just draw some spiders and hang them on the walls. Aim at the drawings whenever you pass one. Overcome your fear of bugs while you train. You want me to draw spiders? Ew, no! Would that even help? Yes, I should know. Huh? You were scared of them too? I was, but they don't bother me anymore. Okay, you've talked me into it. I'll give it a try. And don't hang them where other people might pass. <laughs> got it, got it. Learn my lesson. Promise. I'm choosing to believe that. That was pretty funny. Why did I do that? That was a bad idea. <laughs> Strong, but yeah. 
you're sweet, thanks. God damn it. I figured that'd be good for the quest, but apparently it's not. Oh no, I did finish the quest. Thanks so much. Thanks so much. You're, a You're a sweetheart. sweetheart. So I could have fished them on the first day, God. Damn it. You're sweet. Fish was that? That was like going super fast and then super slow and then super fast and then super slow. What the fuck? Delicious as mother's cooking. I would happily eat this every day. 
This food is a revelation. <laughs> I can't help but smile when I eat it. Flavor is nostalgic to me for some reasons. Hmm, I'd like some more. You should continue eating, of course. However, do you mind answering a few questions?
Yes, but no offense to Big Mats or anime. But let's keep my option open. options open to see what I support. the cathedral because I need to freaking harmonize and then I need to get a freaking fire practice in. okay, but I should really have a cute dance to go along with it. I can't sing very loud. Dear Goddess, even with the, the Goddess, I hope the Church... I'm getting the Need something. This one? You're all set. This one? You're all set. See you again soon. that were caught me off guard. I was actually just thinking about you. Just a moment ago? Well, I... I... I, I am afraid I just do not understand you. When we first met, I sensed something different about you. Something mysterious. And now I am convinced your existence itself is very special. Thinking on it, I know it to be true. You have a crest that should have been lost long ago. You wield the sword of the Creator as if it is nothing. 
Your hair and eye color changed on that day five years ago. To the same sort of color as mine and my brother's. I do not know. My brother refuses to speak to me of it. Since then, you have led us into battle and, thus far, we have always come out victorious. Your comrades and colleagues adore you. They believe in you, in your strength. I doubt there is a single soul who is likened to you. Who are you, really? I simply do not understand. Whatever the case may be, having hair like mine is proof that there is something exceptional about you. I may as well come forward with things. I too am unlike others. Surely you recall when I was targeted, specifically for my blood? I may not be special in the ways you are, but my blood is rare. It seems the two of us share a special... differentness. I also believe that we are bound together in some way. Of this I am certain. Therefore, I intend to stay by your side and watch over you. Your existence must be preserved at all costs. Certainly those are the words of a hero. Let us unite our powers. Together, we are unstoppable. Professor! Welcome! Come back soon! Damn it, that's not what I want to do. Welcome! Come back soon! Hello there! This one, yes? This one, yes? This one, yes? I thank you. Return soon, please. Hello there. This one, yes? I thank you. This one, yes? Yes? I thank this one, yes? I thank this one, yes? This one, yes? I thank you. Return soon, please. Hey, welcome. You have a good eye. You have a good eye. A pleasure doing business with you. You have a good eye. A ple 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 you have a good eye. A pleasure to come again. Welcome. Come back soon. What do you require?
Farewell. What do you require? Do you want to hire this battalion? Do you want to hire... Ready for orders. Farewell. Hey there. The girl looks the same, but now she's in yellow instead of... Uh... Is this it? There you go. Is this it? There you go. Come back anytime. I'm gonna have some grinding to get some money back. Was she then? She was probably somewhere at the beginning that I just ran past her, probably. Thank <laughs> you. 
Seems my practice has paid off. Still got it. That was rather productive. Perhaps I'll expand the scope of my research. I believe you. Was helpful. There is always more to learn. That was helpful. It seems my said if I have so many fucking questions. Natural. Let's not exaggerate. Thank you. 
I forgot to compl I completely forgot to check the goals. Like who was doing what? Woo! Finally done. Feeling pretty good about this. Cynthia, why do you do this to me? Marianne, why? Some things you can't learn in a book. I am getting to the heart of it. Let's put it to the test. I still have much to learn. I've learned a thing or two from battle. Lysithia, why do you hate your professor? Marianne, why do you hate your professor? <laughs> oh god, this shit bugs me so much. Why do you do this? Well, in battle, they'll probably get it over with, but still, that's not the point. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm gonna end it here, guys, just for now. If you like what you see, consider. If you like what you see, consider. Cause, oh my god. If you like what you see and you wanna see more of it, click on that subscribe button. It helps out the channel. And if you want to, leave a like and let me know that you enjoyed the video. Or you can leave a comment. Whatever. Whatever works for you guys. <laughs> and I'll see you guys. Thanks for you. He's an A guy. Damn it. Alright. See you guys. I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace.